In California, water levels at most of the state's reservoirs are less than half their maximum limit. It's so bad, some residents haven't had safe drinking water in weeks, and farmers are suffering too. The Golden State is a major agricultural exporter, so a hit to its food economy could translate into higher prices for fruits and vegetables here in Canada. Months after a state of emergency was declared, drought conditions in California are only getting worse. Now over 82% of the state is categorized as enduring extreme drought. Water barely trickles out of Becky Quintana's faucet, and even that is not drinkable. We have bacteria, and just recently they noticed us, telling us that we have nitrates. Quintana is hardly alone. Over a million people in California don't have safe water coming out of their tap um, on an annual basis. The state has had three consecutive years of below normal rainfall. Farmers and winemakers are suffering catastrophic losses. In Central Valley alone, growers will lose an estimated $800 million this year, with grapes literally dying on the vine. A University of California Davis drought study shows the economic impact on California will total $2.2 billion this year. The agricultural industry will lose $1.5 billion and lose over 17,000 seasonal jobs. A dire situation that may last for years. Winemakers say new vines they plant need a lot more water than established vines. Because if you can't plant today, you're not going to have any wine grapes in three or four or five years. See, the nuts have already been removed. That's the lack the of water has also hurt almond growers, pushing up the harvest three weeks. I think we've done the best that we could do with a limited amount of water. And, and a lot of almond growers used at half the normal allotment of water and had to figure out how to make that do this year. Firefighters are now forced to get water out of ponds, creeks, and rivers. Crews battling the wildfire in Shasta County recently ran out of water and had to let structures burn. If we don't have water to drink with, we're surely not going to have to fight fire with. While Californians hope for rain, meteorologists are not hopeful, predicting drought conditions will continue until 2015. Jennifer Johnson, Global News, Washington.